everybody. Tennis coach Robert here with carlbotennis.com. Nice sunny day here in Florida. Just want to say a few things here before we get started. Uh, the primary purpose of these videos are for injury prevention and stroke efficiency. So um, one of the things we have to do is with all my videos, again, injury prevention. Let's see if we can work as the, to the best of our abilities to make sure we don't injure ourselves. So we're working on the basic stuff and the simple th stuff and making sure that we do it over and over without causing any injuries and making sure that we are also hitting the ball as efficiently as possible. One of the things that I want you guys to do, many of you watch many, many videos, is that you have to go ahead and watch the video and shadow along with it. Watching the video and looking at me as entertainment isn't really going to help you improve tennis because that's what you are here to do. You're here to look at me and get ideas from me so that you can take these ideas to improve to get to be a better tennis player. Okay, so many people have heard are watching videos and are just watching them for entertainment but not actually going out and practicing them. So this is another shadow video that I've done and I'm going to do sorry and uh, we'll go ahead and get started with it. So one of the things that I like to talk about is uh, using some tools here to help you, this pole here, to help you with your take back and follow through. So one of the things that I've, happens is that people will go ahead and take the racket back way too far. Again, looking at highly skilled, incredible athletes that are professionals who are doing this hours upon hours upon hours a day. We're going way back here to try to generate this incredible power and so on but it's not really gonna help us to get the ball in the court. We're gonna make more mistakes and we're gonna injure ourselves, okay? So what we wanna do is wanna go ahead and abbreviate the backswing and focus on the follow through. So when I take my racket back here, I'm gonna stop. It's gonna stop me at this pole. And at this point in time, I'm gonna rotate all the way across. Okay, so I wanna make sure that I am here okay and then I rotate my body across just like again like I'm swinging through we don't want to make sure we don't want to go up like this because now I'm using my arm you can see I want to use my body to swing through okay when I use my arm trying to do this I'm gonna hurt my bicep and tricep and um, we want to make sure that we go across here once some top spin of course we bend the knees and come up we don't do this business again that's gonna cause problems so we want to go ahead and practice this. So we stand here. I have this uh, a little line here that I imagine standing straight forward. The racket is a little bit in front of me. Then I'm going to take my foot, step forward, and I'm going to just bring the racket forward. I'm going to start this by bringing my hips and then letting my racket come through. So it stops here, swing, and I want this motion to be continuous until it hits my arm right around here okay so it goes here swing keeps going all the way until it stops here it doesn't have to be fast okay but it has to be continuous I don't want this okay that's gonna also cause problems injuries stopping here puts stress on my arm and then I do this again going fast again stress we just want to use the body to go right across so once we get that we want to make sure then we move the feet a little bit step pull and across step pull and across again the focus is on the follow-through it's similar to the punch if I'm gonna punch somebody we go all the way through we don't take it way back and do this we want to make sure we go all the way through so I can start here in the ready position <clears throat> take my racket back move my feet step and all the way across so I'm using this as a guide so I know that I don't take the racket back too far and I'm following through using all my force here, my body to come forward. Take a few steps back or forward here. Take it back without this, stop there, swing and go through. But I'm using this here to make sure that I don't take the racket back too far. When I'm doing this, I can go ahead also and stop here, bounce the ball, hit and follow through. When you do this, the ball should go straight, okay? If, it, if I hook it off to the side, I'm using my arm. So we wanna make sure that we're using the body and the ball should end up going pretty straight forward, okay? <clears throat> so if you have a center mark here, 
three feet on this side, three feet on this side, six feet wide, distancing there, I should be able to hit this ball and follow all the way through. Here, and the ball should go straight across there. <clears throat> so I hope this video has been helpful for you. Simple tip that you can do to make sure that we're not taking the racket back too far. You take the racket back too far, you're gonna miss the ball, you're gonna start using your arm so we can be efficient. So if you go ahead and take, watch this video, and then apply it, it will help you to improve your game. So you, doesn't, you don't necessarily have to have this particular post. You can do it inside your home. You can have a wall, a doorway, as long as you can swing through and make sure. That's gonna help us also with the contact point and all the other things that could go wrong in our shots, okay? So again, apply these things, watch the videos. In some cases, go ahead and follow along with the videos that I've done in the past and make sure that you're doing it and that would definitely help improve your game and also improve your chances of not getting injured because that's what we want to do. We don't want to injure ourselves by doing crazy things that uh, are going to cause problems, okay? Thank you so much. If you enjoyed the video, please go ahead and subscribe. And um, I appreciate all the comments. And thank you, and I'll see you next time. For more information on Carbo Tennis, visit www.carbotennis.com. If you wish to email Coach Robert, please do so at robert at carbotennis.com or visit his Facebook page at www.facebook.com forward slash carbotennis. Tennis for the people. This video was an ADCI LLC production and was filmed at the North Penn Ellis YMCA located in Palm Harbor, Florida.